Do you struggle understanding or working with SFIC cores? Or I don't know, maybe even picking them is a challenge. If you struggle or are curious about any of that, I got a new product just for you. All right, so Ryan, our friend over at Cutaways is at it again. And by popular comment and demand, we now have a SFIC, that's small form and interchangeable core, six pin, a keyway cutaway lock. Let's dive in and take a look. All right, now here are the two options that you, you can buy it in. You can buy it um, keyed up, which we'll be going over here in a minute. And then also you can just buy it um, uncombinated. So let's open it up together and take a look. Ryan, like always, just makes these great little boxes and um, look at that. It just makes it feel extra special if you ask me. And as you can see right here is the six pin a keyway best SFIC cord. And you can see all the chambers here and it's real beautiful. So of course you can get it like this. If you pin up locks yourself, want to give it a try, you can do it. And I tell you what, I don't know if there's a better way to learn pinning these up and um, understanding it at first because a lot of times, right, when you pin it up and you don't know what's going on and then the key doesn't work, you don't really know what to do. So training and using this at first to get you going is awesome. Now remember, this is a real core, right? This is a real a keyway, as you can see right there. And um, I mean, you can put this into use. I mean, you could stick it in a door if you wanted to, but I wouldn't uh, really recommend it because you just, you know, you paid extra money to get it milled. But uh, all right, let's set that aside here and let's look at the uh, pinned core here. Now, this is one, as you can see right here, that you can um, see it all. So like if we were to put this one in, you can see based on the shear line up here that this is the control key, right? It's moving the control key. You can see what's going on there. And if you put this one in, all right, you can see that it works just the standard, um, the working key. Now, why is this important? It's really important, right? Cause you can, you'll be able to tell, well, first of all, just by looking at this, okay? So um, this one just got pinned up to two keys, but I can see just based off the pins in here that there are more keys that are supposed to work it, right? And so um, that's really cool that you're able to see that. You can start to understand why the pin stacks matter and when they're not right. And the other thing is, is that if you you want to work at actually picking SFIC cores, this is really, really going to help you understand what it feels like, what's actually going on. And um, it's just, it's a really great learning tool, actually. All right, so there you go. Pretty awesome, if you ask me. I think once again, Ryan over at Cutaways nailed it right out of the park. It's pretty cool, though, that they come in both the uh, uncombinated, you know, the blank ones, or the keyed up ones because that way, depending on what you wanna use it for, your skill level, that sort of thing, that you can really get the one that you need. And I also think, I don't know if any other um, SFIC core cutaway even exists out there. So pretty cool stuff. Now, of course, I'll have a link in the uh, comments to both of the different products. Go ahead and check them out. And of course, I wanna know what you think in the comments below. Do you think for you, it would be more valuable learning how to pick the lock so you could actually see the feedback and see what's kind of going on inside of the core that previously you've, you haven't been able to see? Or is it one of those things that having one and pinning it up for a new guy can be really helpful to help them understand like why it's not working, why it does work, that sort of thing, getting your pin stacks right. You know what I'm talking about, if you know what I'm talking about. But anyways, I look forward to seeing what you think in the comments below. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Hey, congratulations, you've made it to the end of the video. You probably deserve a medal, maybe a plaque, but hey, I wanna make sure that when you're commenting that you're including the hashtag LockBoss. When you do, you automatically get entered in to win one of five free prizes we're giving away each week here live on YouTube on Tuesdays at 4 p.m. We'll see you in the comments.